I think we should explore this uh, old house, man. Let's go. Whoa. No parking. Whoa. Whoa. So this place is like around 80 years old. I feel like it's more than 80 years. Maybe 200 years. They don't know exactly. Wow, this is, what is this? Oh man, this is cool. This is the interesting part, man. I love exploring the old houses. Whoa, whoa. See the steps, man, so good. Wow. Wow. Ho, ho, ho. What is this happening? It's breaking apart, huh? Whoa. Check this out, man. So good. Hello. <laughs> Whoa. This is crazy awesome. So they're going to actually demolish the whole building, man. I'm so lucky that I'm here now. Wow. Whoa. Crazy, crazy. Wow. Ooh. This is awesome. Man. So this building is going to go away pretty soon. Wow. Crazy. So this is actually literally a step which goes down. This is crazy. Oops. You can't even touch it, man. It's breaking. I really don't want to fall. I love the doors, man, but it's time to go down. Whew. How are you? Guy, I'm good. I mean, check this man, this is like, these gates are so huge, it's like they used to have some elephant or something. Whoa, man. And this place is just on the road. Whoa. So they're dismantling the whole thing, so they're going to get this window or, yeah. Whoa. Whoa, man, this is so beauty, right? This will be gone within a few months or something. Wow. So I was looking for some old ice cream shop, okay? So someone suggested me go this side. There's a deluxe ice cream shop. It's very old. Thank you. So this guy's telling it's somewhere on the back. Yo, here we go. This is the deluxe ice cream shop. Oh, this is cool guys. This is like 50 years old shop. Deluxe ice cream shop. So, I'm so honored to be here. So, he's the owner. And he's the owner. Huh? My friends. Your friend? Yes. Okay, cool. Whoa. This is so good. This is so authentic, you know. So that's the address guys, whenever you come, you come to this place because this is the authentic place. So here we go. Oh. So these are the like few ice cream, but they started the shop around 50 years back. Right? Yeah, so they, they, they used to make like ice candy, but now they have like around 50 recipes. 50? 50 recipes. 50 ice recipes. Oh, that's cool. American dry food, butterscotch, kesar badam pista, bajwadi dry food. So these are their favorite ice cream which sells hot like a hot cake. Okay, so this is their ice cream machine and you know all this thing. Whoa, this is old. Okay, so these are the raw material. Then they make the ice cream out of it. So this guy is the ice cream maker. So he's been like making ice cream for the last 35 years. 
So now the time is to taste the ice cream, man. This is like 50 years old recipe. Awesome, right? That's what, you know, traveling mix that was different. Ooh, he's good to get me. Whoa. So guys, this is um, the this flavor is called pan masala. This is like an Indian pan. This is American dry fruit, kesar pista, kesar malti. Okay, but uh, the thing is that I don't eat pan masala, but I will try pan masala. Mm. It's good. So. So now this is American dry fruit. So it's time for American dry fruit. This is Kesar Malti. Malti. What is Malti? Huh. Ah, okay. So he's a uh, a younger one and he's the elder one. Thank you. Okay. Or this is the shop guys. The ice cream was so good. It's old, 50 years old recipe, man. I'm like honored to be there. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Everywhere you go, you find a magic, man. That's a good thing about the old side of any town. Let's get inside. So this place is like around 120 years old. This is the way to go up, but it's blocked. Whoa, this is crazy, man. This place is like 120 years old, and they have shops, they have everything. Ooh, Ooh that's a place. But the entry is closed. Awesome. Oh, this is the place, man. It's built of wooden. Oh, this is crazy, man. It's pretty cold here. So, this was built on like 1915. 1905. 1905. 1905. Huh? 1805. 1905. 1905. 1905. This whole place was built on like October 1905. Whoa. He actually told me, like, go, go inside and check it out. That's good, right? Thank you, Danyavad. Welcome, welcome. So guys, I'm going to show you uh, jaggery, like four or five types of jaggery. So one is this, it's like, it's like a, you know, like the liquid stuff, I don't know. So one is this, the other one is this, with the honeybee. And you have this one, and you have this. So let's try this one. Oh, maybe this thing. <laughs> it's so sweet. <laughs> so this shop is like more than 100 years old. Whoa. It's like pre-independent. Awesome. Hello, thank you. Oh man, today is the ice cream day. So this place is like around 109 years old. So one more ice cream. Why not? You know? Let's go. Whoa. Hello. So this was started by his great grandfather and they have like around uh, eight yeah, shop. Fourth generation. Four generation, eight shop, huh? Okay. Whoa, this place looks good man. Whoa. A very very American style, huh? Okay. Iranian style. Iranian style. Iranian. Ah, this is unique, right? Whoa. This place is literally clean, man. Whoa, I love it. Cool. Kesar pista. Mm -hmm. uh, vanilla. Eh? Vanilla. Coconut. Coconut. Special badam. Special badam. Chocolate. Dark chocolate dry food. Okay. So he got around 32 flavors. Both vanilla, kaju huh? drugs, or special badam. Okay, these are the four flavors. Awesome. Oh. Cool. 1913. Oh. So this is one of the unique things. This is like Raja Ravi Varman's uh, paintings print. So this, this 
painting's print may be like around 200 years old. Awesome. This is cool, right? So, I mean, like when you come to those old places, they still preserve the thing. That's very interesting. Cool. Oh man, when you come to Gujarat and you don't see the cow, oh, it's impossible. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode because it was like chaotic and very interesting, right? Cool. So that's a cow again, one more cow. I've never seen Rajkot, you know, in this, there's hardly any traffic, man. i never seen that. It's just because of the rain and there is hardly any two-wheelers. Mm, so rain makes a lot of difference, you know. Rain cleans the city, it gives a fresh air and settles the dust. So, and of course, there's a lot of agriculture growth. So we are still waiting for the signal. <laughs>